I'm Tom Hathaway. I'm wearing my BA hat, so let's talk business analysis. In this nugget, I'm going to introduce an agile approach to identifying stakeholders early in the project. We're going to talk about when to recognize uh, when you're done identifying stakeholders. These techniques will help you when you are the one wearing the BA. Imagine planning a, quote, surprise, end quote, wedding without proposing to your bride-to-be. Imagine starting a project to remodel your house without consulting with your spouse. Imagine adding an additional floor to your house without consulting the local zoning authorities. These three are but a few of the wonderful hypothetical scenarios that describe the real-life situation in which some organizations initiate information technology, or IT, projects without including all relevant stakeholders. Involving the right decision makers is one of the critical success factors for any project, IT or otherwise. To involve them, you have to first figure out who they are. Stakeholder identification is one of the most important steps in the early phases of any project. Missing a single stakeholder might endanger the entire project. At the very least, discovering missed stakeholders late in the project is a major contributing factor to scope creep. How can you avoid this pitfall? The best and most obvious place to start is with the project sponsor, aka the person with the idea. The first stakeholder on any project is that sponsor, who in a perfect world is also the individual who has a the funding necessary to pay for the project, b the savvy to know what the project will ultimately deliver, and c the political clout needed to get the project staffed i.e. getting you assigned to define the solution. The project sponsor is the perfect first candidate to help you identify additional stakeholders, provided you ask the right questions. Early in the project, the sponsor's idea is usually vague. It's more of a vision of what the solution should be, as opposed to a detailed description of the outcome, let alone a specific step-by-step -step set of instructions for building the thing. That's fine. That is the sponsor's role. Ergo, we say that he or she, quote, envisions, end quote, the solution. Your challenge, then, is to figure out how to identify who all of the stakeholders might be based on this vague vision. Where to start? 